There are increasing tensions between Israelis and Palestinians in Jerusalem, the fate of which is one of the most contentious issues in the Israel-Arab conflict. The BBC's Erika Chernovska takes a closer look at why this city is so important to Christianity, Islam and Judaism, the three religions which trace their shared origins back to the biblical figure of Abraham. Jerusalem. Its name resonates in the hearts of Christians, Jews and Muslims alike and echoes through centuries of shared and disputed history. Known in Hebrew as Yerushalayim and in Arabic as Al-Quds, it is one of the oldest cities in the world. It has been conquered, destroyed and rebuilt time and again, and every layer of its earth reveals a different piece of the past. While it has often been the focus of stories of division and conflict among people of different religions, they are united in their reverence for this holy ground. At its core is the old city, a maze of narrow alleyways and historic architecture that characterizes its four quarters, Christian, Muslim, Jewish and Armenian. It is surrounded by a fortress-like stone wall and home to some of the holiest sites in the world. Each quarter represents its own population. The Christians have two, because Armenians are also Christians, and their quarter, the smallest of the four, is one of the oldest Armenian centers in the world. It is unique in that their community has preserved its own particular culture and civilization inside the St. James Church and Monastery, which comprises most of their section. Thank you for watching. This is Silver Marquee TV. Please subscribe, like, share and comment and also hit the notification bell icon to notify for more videos to be uploaded. We have an outstanding view of the old city of Jerusalem. Here it is, Haram e Sharif, the Dome of the Rock, which commemorates, according to the Islam, the site of Muhammad's ascension to heaven after his visit to this place. We are on the way now to the Western Wall. It was known also for many, many years as the Wailing Wall. The Jews used to come and wail and mourn over the destruction of the two temples.